to make chocolate bars may seem so easy but well let's watch this video after this video we'll decide whether it's easy or very time consuming first we need our cocoa and this is what we have here all i'm going to do here is to divide it okay whichever way you want to divide it so you unveil what is inside just do it but i'm using the knife to just cut it round and then i will just break it into two and this is what we have inside of it okay you see this right here you can eat it yes you can eat it it doesn't really taste sweet it has some sour taste or something yeah so it's okay after you eat this is what you should have this is what the seed should look like i'm just going to take everything okay from the pot and then i'm going to be putting it into this calabash it's not necessary to use a calabash you can just use any bowl or anything you have available where you think you can scoop this in it and then all we are going to do from here is to cover it and allow it to ferment so you see from the inside this is how it looks look at the color it looks so beautiful so i'm going to ferment this for about three days and after the third day i will dry it for an extra four days making it seven days okay so this is the dried one i couldn't capture when it fermented properly for the three days yes so i'm going to put this in the oven and this is what we have right here now I'm, all i'm going to do is to peel this okay i'm going to peel this and then you baking it make it so easy for you to peel it yes so i'm going to do that for the remaining and you know all the details will be in the description so do your best to read the description it's going to give you all the details you need to make this so after peeling this is what we have here it's not that much but we can still make some good chocolate out of this okay and this is what we have so with this i couldn't use my hands to crush it so i'm putting it into this zip log where i'm going to be using something to heat it so that it can break into smaller pieces yes to break to that it will be easy for it to blend very well in the blender i do not want to stress my blender too much so i realize i still have to go for a second time and that is exactly what i did okay i just did this and so since you've watched the video to this very stage let let me know in the comments okay if you think making homemade chocolate is really really time consuming yes let me know so all i'm going to do is to transfer this into the blender where i'm going to be blending and also i'll add some sugar to it so you can add sugar to it because this is very bitter i won't lie it's very very bitter even if you add the sugar you still taste some kind of bitterness but you know it's it's bitter yeah it's bitter so i can imagine the amount of sugar being put into our chocolates yeah so i'm going to put this into a blender and then i'll blend it till it's smoothing to a certain extent you want to blend this okay to form powder from powder it will now become liquid and this is it this is the powder form all i'm going to do here is to add some olive oil you can add coconut oil you can add maybe butter melted butter if that is what you have available so with this i'm going to be blending until i get something like this this alone can be your chocolate spread but if you want it to be in a bar form then you just put it in any mode of your choice and then you put it in the fridge for some time and after some minutes your chocolate bar is just ready and do not forget to like share your thoughts in the comments and also subscribe if you haven't done that yet okay do want to subscribe click on the bell notification icon so you do not miss out on anything i do next time well this is my first time trying this and i hope you enjoy this video and you find it so so helpful let me know in the comments if you are going to give this a try okay it tastes good and i do not add milk if you are making yours you can add milk okay while you blend so that after you put everything in the fridge it will come out 
very nice and milky i use just the sugar and the olive oil thank you so so much for watching and then i will see you on the next one until then stay safe bye